chapter 14 verse 10. He says, I'm 85 years now. But I'm still strong. I'm still ready for war. Amen. Hallelujah. You know why? You know why he's saying this? You know why he's saying this? Because he's trusting in the presence of God. Very beautifully he says in verse in verse 12 he says verse 12 and 13 he says my God will be with me. I know there are giants there. I know there are great fortified cities. It's okay. But he says my, my God will be with me and he will help me drive out all these giants from this place. Give me a broad. Joshua. Amen. Hallelujah. If you feel lost today, Amen. If you have backslidden, if you have stopped reading the Bible, then you know, you cannot have the strength from the Lord. Because Caleb was able to say after 45 years, at the age of 85, he was able to say, I can do it. Because he was doing his homework properly. You three are speaking with you. He was doing, believer, I'm speaking with you. Christian, I'm speaking with you. If you have forgotten to read your Bible, if you have forgotten to pray, if you have forgotten to fast, then you will feel weak. Then you will not be able to say like Khaled. But Khaled was did his homework. He regularly had a communication with God. 45 years he got up in the morning. 45 years he spent time in the world. 45 years he spent, he got, he meditated on the promise of God. In Deuteronomy chapter 136, God says, Khaled shall see it. And to him and his children, I will give the land on which he has trodden because he has only followed the Lord. A 99% Christian cannot roar like a lion. He will become like a rat when problem comes. God gives the strength of a lion to a Christian who wholeheartedly follows him. 